Hello, and I must say it's always a real pleasure to be broadcasting from this part of the USA. We're at Lumen Field. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary is Stuart Robson. And every reason to believe we're in for an entertaining match here. It's the United States versus France. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And that pass could be troublesome. Spectacular save. Top class goalkeeping. She has teammates around her. No problems for the keeper. And France come away with it. And a throw in forthcoming. Well, the perfect tackle, really. And now a throw in. Going well. Look, look as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Oh, could be! And it's come off the keeper! Oh, she was razor sharp! The keeper just couldn't stop her! Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately, it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. And France get the ball moving again. Can they come up with an answer here? Kashawi, Bilbo, and offside it is. Becky Sauerbrunn. Now looking towards the back post. And in the end, no damage done. Can they convert? Oh, that is a moment of pure quality. A goal for football lovers to enjoy the world over. Well, this is a brilliant finish. Great awareness, good technique, and a bit of composure as well. What an excellent goal that is. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. No degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper. And that is going to be a free kick. Well, not enough subtlety about that free kick, I'm afraid. Well, approaching half-time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game, they've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. Firing it towards goal, and she's hit it with real authority, just over the crossbar, though. That is how to apply the pressure. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. Tonetti. Might be a chance here. And with that, the first half draws to it. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. I think most defenders would expect to be booked halting an attack in that fashion. 
And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Has eyes for goal! Well, fair to say, she didn't really make life difficult for the goalkeeper. Untidy in possession. Superb block. This might be ideal for the counter. Kadijatu Jani. Here's Katoto. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. And the keeper more than equal to it. Well, there it is. The hosts haven't had that much of the ball. But when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. Oh, it's developing nicely for them here. Well, the break was on, but she stopped them in their tracks. Well, doesn't have to do it on her own. But quick thinking defensively. Twenty minutes remaining. And France finding space on the flank. He got in the way of that cross. Deflected behind. Corner forthcoming. And a substitution in the offing. And played in. Well, it still could be dangerous. Gives it a go. And a fine stop. And there's the delivery. A very effective clearance. Sakina Karshawi. Well, they have it again. Ten minutes left for play. A foul it most certainly was. Free kick given. Well, she's escaped the caution. Some might say it could have been a yellow card. And a timely intervention. Well, the supporters think it's on. Well, sadly, she's got that one horribly wrong. And if she had a chance again, I think she'd probably hit through the back of the ball rather than trying to chip it. That's a wasted opportunity. Good tackle. It'll be a throw. Marie-Antoinette Catoto. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. An incisive pass. And there it is, the final whistle. And the fans will be leaving the stadium with smiles on their faces. Well, Derek, it was a couple...